Today on our 2014 Jeep Patriot, we'll be installing the Pollock six pole round pin trailer wiring socket with exposed terminals and a rubber boot for the vehicle end. Part number PK11608. Now we'll be working here on the front of the vehicle. This vehicle already has bulb and socket wiring with the four flat routed up underneath the lower fascia. We'll also be using the two prongs that are on the existing base plate that's already been mounted on the vehicle. We'll use these two prongs to mount our new six pole round pin adapter. We're first gonna have to go ahead and bend these two tabs down just a little bit on our existing base plate to allow our new six pin connector to fit properly. To do this, we'll use a paper towel and a boxed in wrench to bend the tab down slightly. We're using the paper towel so we don't scratch the finish on the base plate. Now that we have both of the bracket tabs bent down far enough, next we're gonna go ahead and cut the end of the four flat off, even with the original four flat connector. We'll then go ahead and strip each of the wires back enough that they'll fit into the back of the new six pin properly. Next, we need to go ahead and pull the rubber boot off the back of the new six pin and slide it over our four flat wiring. As once we make our connections, you will not be able to put the boot on. So go ahead and slide it on your wiring now so you don't forget. Now we're ready to go ahead and do our wiring into the back of the six pin plug. We'll take the white wire, which is the ground wire, and connect it to the location that has a G on it. This will be the ground on the new six pin. Next, we'll take the brown wire and go to the location that has a T on it. It will be just to the right of the white wire when you're looking at it. Next, we'll go ahead and skip one of the holes and go down to the next one that has an R on it. This is for the right turn and break, so we'll be putting the green wire to this one. And the final wire, we'll be using the yellow wire and we'll put it on the L terminal, which is the left turn and break. On this particular application, we're only using the four flat wiring. So we're only using the white, the brown, the yellow, and the green. Now that we've got all our wires connected, we can go ahead and slide our rubber boot back up over the back of the new six pin. We'll use a little electrical tape to secure it. Now we can go ahead and use the two self-tapping screws that actually came with the vehicle's base plate kit to attach our new six pin to it. Now we're also gonna go ahead and use a small section of wire loom over the back of the wires to give it a little better protection as well as make the appearance a little neater. That'll conclude our installation of the Pollock six pole round pin trailer wiring socket with exposed terminals and a rubber boot for the vehicle in part number PK11608 on our 2014 Jeep Patriot.